Good evening, everybody. How are we doing tonight? All right, it's time for some more FE12. We made a ton of progress yesterday. Yesterday, uh, ever since we decided to stop reading Chris uh, support conversations, and also uh, not caring if we kill you units, because <laughs> we have such a core at this point that like the extra units don't really matter. <laughs> like they're not that good. For like what I need so like they're not worth it it's just like if it's more convenient to kill them it's more convenient to kill them or or in S case uh, accidentally get killed by a ambush spawn horseman and get one shot that was rough that was really rough but yeah we are on chapter 16 X I believe which I I'm leaning towards this is going to be the Katarina chapter where we have a chance to recruit her we'll see how that goes because again i'm playing this like semi-blind so i don't really know how to recruit her per se i'm gonna try to not kill her because staff units are good uh but we'll see what happens um so let's see announcements for the week uh should be streaming wednesday friday this weekend may be a little dodgy. I'm going somewhere on Saturday and Sunday. I may just be too cut to beat uh, from all the driving and stuff. So we'll see how we'll see how we're feeling. Um, but yeah, let's just uh, get into the game. Let's mute the music. Switch over. Got to return on my controller for like the third time. All right, let's do this. Once my controller reconnects. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, Mr. Dual Sense. There we go. Alright, reunion. So the Altean army has reclaimed Altea Castle. Master Garnef is rightfully livid. Lady Aramaya. And yet, Ein, all you can do is stand there, doing nothing. Are you not ashamed of being alive? This lady's fucked up. To die for my sake, is that not the natural recourse? Yes. I, you are worthless trash. There is no value in your life. You're a child the world never wanted. Tell me, who is it that saved you? Who should you thank for allowing your wretched existence to continue? It's all thanks to you, Lady Aramaya. Kill them. But, Lady Aramaya, I... Silence, worthless puppet. You cannot defy my orders. That's what I've taught you since you were little. The words I engraved upon your then young soul will remain there forever. Oh, -ho! I'll use you until you break, my little puppet. God, this this person's fucked up. Another attack from those assassins. We finally reclaimed our homeland, yet we don't even get a moment of rest. Being attacked by assassins in Altea reminds me of your knighthood ceremony. You and that assassin, Katarina, spent your days training at the same Sam platoon. However, this is no time for sentimentality. Flair, you are to protect Prince Marth, just like you did that day. Alright. We, we got a few support conversations. Minerva and Palin Catria. Commander, Princess Minerva? Oh, Pala, training again? Yes, that was my plan, but I shall refrain for today. More importantly, Commander, what were you pondering about just now? I'm sad to say, my own inexperience shames me. In the previous war, we of House Macedon fought amongst ourselves and led the kingdom into disarray. This time again, I lacked the strength to bring order to the kingdom and thus allowed the fires of rebellion to burn. But that's... it is fine. I know I forced many troubles upon you too. Forgive me. Commander, if you commit a mistake, isn't it enough to simply correct it? During your reign, I joined your side because I believed in your ideal. And even now, I'll continue to fight by your side with the best of my limited abilities. So please raise your head. Thank you, Pala. Your words bring me comfort. In order to rebuild our homeland as soon as we can, please lend me your strength for a little while longer. Gladly, Commander. Good, good. I know I'm pushing you too far. The war isn't over yet. Please lend me your strength for a little while longer. Taking care of your wyvern, Commander? If you're just talking to it, then I could do it in your place. No, this is something I must do myself. We can't fight properly during battle if there isn't trust between Ryder and Wyvern, after all. Just like Pegasus training. I see, but you're well informed if you know about Pegasus training. That's because I used to be a Pegasus Rider myself. 
Is that true? I honestly had no idea. What's wrong? Commander, why did you switch from Pegasus to a Wyvern? Are you curious? Yes, forgive me, have I asked too much? I don't mind, it isn't such a private matter. To put it simply, I had to become stronger. Macedon is in a large kingdom, and there's only one reason it's recognized by other kingdoms as an independent nation. Because of its legion of Draco Knights. So to symbolize Macedon's might, those of House Macedon must ride wyverns. And that's why I released my Pegasus into the forest uh, and, and took the wyvern whip. So that's what happened. I wonder if the Pegasus I befriended is still in Macedon's forest. Once this war is over and peace returns, I'd like to go see how he's faring. It's almost time for the war council already. I'm going ahead, Katria. Commander is truly a gentle, peace-loving soul. I wonder if the white wings of Pegasus would truly be best suited for her. All right, those are the only, like, actual relevant conversations. Board Court X! What's the Board Court X? Owned by Board and Court of Talus. I mean, it's honestly not terrible. It's probably just like a slightly better Iron Axe. All right, how many units do we have? Only seven. Geez. Uh, what's the map looking like actually? All right. So having a good sword unit, um, honestly, like, I feel this is pretty fine. I don't really see, like, any way to really improve, improve this team. It's, like, just really good. Just got everything I need. Uh, let's see. I will get rid of some of these things. I can have a silver lance now, which is good. So let's, uh, let's equip that real quick. So I have an actual, like, good option to use. Um, let's see. Could probably use... Honestly, I should give you, like, a Fire Tome or something. Just so you have some way to counterattack. She does fine as a Paladin. You don't need two Silver Swords. Why do you have two Silver Swords? Grab an iron sword for weapon triangle. Actually, it's not even gonna matter that much. Yeah, it'll st it'll still help. It'll still help. That. Let's get a fresh heal stat. Also, I can use physic now, which is really sick. Pretty good at this point. Let's see how this plays out. Katarina. Flair, Prince Marth. Katarina, if you have reasons, I would like to hear them. I'm sure we could settle this without resorting to fighting. I'm sorry, I have no choice but to do this. I'm sure we could talk this out. Uh, let's see. It does actually help quite a bit with crit rate, because they don't get weapon triangle advantage on me, which is just as important. Alright, so if I can kill, like, say, this one, then Pala can fly over and kill one of the archers. Like, just look at Marth, he's insane. Pala can fly over. Kill this assassin. Alright. Pala, what are you getting? What's your final level up? Pretty good. You have capped you have capped offenses. Pretty sick. I'm actually curious, can Melissa even do anything? Nah, no, she can't. So 
So like, she could kill. Do I wanna like, hold, just like hold a choke? Hey, what's up Sakura, how's it going? You're all good. Let's see. Actually, I <laughs> she's still better avoid wise. I think I'll just have her have an iron sword. Then I think I think we're gonna just try to hold up for a little bit and see what ha see how what happens. I am a puppet. My exists only to serve Lady Aramaya. My life has no value. How depressing. How many hours? Ooh, this ain't, this ain't looking great, actually. Oh, that's actually very good. More than six? Yeah, Persona games are long. You still probably have a decent chunk to go. That's the funniest part. Marth is faster than a swordsmaster? Oh my god. Oh, you finally beat it? Oh, yeah, that's what I that's where I was looking. That's where I was looking. Alright, Katarina. Katarina. Claire, I had a dream. It was short, but it was a very happy dream. Both you and I, both of us became royal guards. We saved many people, received many thanks, and then the two of us... Claire, I... I'm sorry. I'm talking nonsense. There's no going back for me. Let's resume the battle. Dang, she sucks. You'll get there eventually. It's, it's just a long game. I don't, the, the new, the next content isn't like, it's probably maybe like an extra like 15 hours, which in the, maybe like 10 to 15, which in the grand scheme of things is not that much. The grand persona scheme. I think it's better if I just, how do I want to kill these guys? Also, then you'll uh, you'll eventually get uh, uh, Kasumi, and uh, she's awesome. So that'll be fun. that's something to look forward to. Because of course, even though she was advertised in the in the royal version, you don't actually get to play play her at all, which is funny. Pal's not getting any XP anymore, but, you know, she's still good for killing things. I knew it. I'm gonna have to keep talking to you, Katarina, aren't I? I think that's where we're going. God, 23 damage to Sirius? That's gross. Flair, there's nothing less for us to say. You and I are enemies. Please fight me. If you don't, I'll kill you. No, I refuse. Um, how do I want to do this? A block like that. Oh, she does like no damage. 
Marth, though? Well, Marth can actually do it, but it's a little scary. So I'm just gonna have Cecile. Cecile do it. Cecile, like, if I need if I need somebody to die, to die, Cecile's got me covered. That's probably capped. Oh, wow, skill still isn't capped. It's low-key kind of impressive. How much attack? Oh my god, they almost one-shot Cecile just because of her HP. Just because she has no defense. She's all HP. So funny, actually. How much? Uh, chances are she'd live. Katarina, you gonna stop that? Just like, just join me already. get this kill. This is a nice setup for somebody. I guess Sheeta. She'll just barely live. Yeah, I figured she, should, she could get more speed. She has plenty more speed to get. All right. Katarina, listen to me. Flair, why? Why do you refuse to fight? You must know that you'll die if you don't kill me. And yet, why do you hesitate? Because you're my friend. You can't have forgotten our days training as knights, the times we fought together with Luke, Rody, Ryan, and Cecile. Together, we'd be an unstoppable team. That's what you told me. Flair. That's a wonderful name. We're here for the same reason, then. My name is Katarina. I came because I wish to serve Prince Marth. Thank goodness. Flair, you won. I knew you could do it. I I'd like to be a royal guard, if you're in with me. Together, we'd be an unstoppable team. When I imagine a future like that, I feel very happy. Uh, what about you, Flair? Do you perhaps feel the same as I? That was... That was all a lie. Everything I did was to deceive you. It was all just a ruse. The truth is, I don't care about you. If that's the case. Then why are you crying? I'm not. Katarina, you don't belong there. You want to fight alongside me for Prince Marth, I'm certain of it. It's too late for that. I've committed too many unforgivable sins. Then you'll just have to start atoning for them. It won't be easy. Many people from both Altea and your organization will turn you a cold shoulder. But I can promise you this, no matter what happens, I'll stand by your side. Flair, return to us, Katarina. Flair. And that's it. We did it. Easy map. Prince Marth, I have committed many unforgivable sins. Please hand me punishment worthy of my crimes. Please execute me. Raise your head, Katarina. I have no intention of taking your life. But why? I don't deserve to live. Please let me atone with my death. That's no atonement. You're just running from your sins. Oh. If you truly regret what you've done, then live. I want you to atone with your life, not your death. Atone with my life? But how? What should I do? How could I even begin to atone? I cannot give you that answer. Until then, until now, you've only followed orders, never thinking for yourself. That's going to change now. You will think for yourself and find your own answer. That is my punishment to you. Prince Marth. Nice quick chapter to oh, to start it up. Grass Setting Sun, chapter 17. We're definitely in the end game now. Marth once again departed from Altea, heading towards the capital of Arcanea. However, the Kingdom of Grah, allied to Arcanea, stood in their path. Grah allied with Dolor in the previous war. King Geo fell in battle and the kingdom was lost. Grah was annexed to Altea at one point, but by Emperor Hardin's order, was returned to Arcanea. Hardin uh, found King Geo's daughter, Princess Shinma. It's Shinna, not Shima. 
dang translation, and allowed her to take the throne, providing support to Grom. Sheena received fanatical support from her people. To them, Sheena was their only hope. The youths volunteered to become soldiers one after another, and then happily moved out to exact revenge on Altia, their bitter enemy. However, their dreams were shattered. Before the fast approaching Altian elites, the Grawl soldiers lost the will to fight and started fleeing for their lives. Gra's army is renowned for its mighty armor knights and generals. The late King Geo, our enemy in the last war, was a general himself. Ah, I see. An army with strong defenses. In the past, yes. I hear Gra's army now consists of new recruits. Hardly worthy enemies. Speaking of strong defenses, Flair, uh, your defense could do with a little more work. It's quite worrisome. Look, Flair, the enemies may be new recruits, but don't underestimate them. Thanks for telling me I suck. All right. So, we have Katarina now. She's like... She, she's fine. She's fine. She exists. Uh, let's first check if there's chests on this map. I'm definitely sensing chests on this map. There's a village. I'm definitely gonna need a thief. actual like units to, to worry about uh not right now okay so we're gonna need a thief or at least somebody with a door key what do i want to do with pala do i want to reclass her into something different She would actually be an insane Swordsmaster. That's actually very tempting, because then she'd be able to, she'd still have really good strength. And she'd be able to keep up in speed, but she would lose a lot of weapon rank, which would kind of suck. It's worth considering changing her class, though, at some point. Like, <laughs> she'd be a funny general. She'd be a very funny general. I think we'll keep her as Draco Knight, though. She's still just gonna, like, carry carry the, the fuck out of my team. Uh, so who do I drop, though? So I need Julian. Maybe I'll drop Sirius. I feel like Minerva's, like, not even that good anymore. I feel like I sh actually, like, actively struggle to use Minerva. Again, just like we're taking the dream team, and that's all we need anymore. Uh, I could definitely use a silver lance on her, get rid of the steel, get a fresh steel. Uh, Katarina, I'm gonna save that nose for out to you for seal. Get L fire. Yeah, we'll just have her be like a staff bot, like a secondary staff bot to compliment Melissa. Melissa in the back. We're probably gonna have Pala just like annihilate these guys. Looking pretty good. Gras troops. 
So I have a report. Our enemy is a mixed army of Arcanean soldiers and Gras soldiers. It seems Gras soldiers have no will to fight and simply are being coerced by Arcanean's men. Then if we defeat the Arcanean soldiers, we may not need to battle those from Gras. We want to avoid pointless sacrifice as much as possible. Convey that to everyone. Alright, so we just need to defeat the Arcanean soldiers. Got it. We have reclaimed our homeland, Altea, and now we're going to have a divisive battle against Arcanea, our enemy. We will head to the palace, the hub of Arcanea, and defeat Garnef, who kidnapped Princess Elise. And to liberate Emperor Harden from the Dark Sphere's control. According to Lord Goto himself, Garnef is gathering high class uh, clerics, Princess Elise among them. His objectives are unknown, but we must f uh, free them quickly. However, to reach the palace, we have to pass through the Kingdom of Gra, now Arcanea's pawn. Alright, sounds good. Let's see how this goes. Princess Sheena, the Altean army is coming. I see, the end draws near. Samson, I ought to apologize for burdening you. However, I must see my kingdom through to the very end. You may go. That's quite enough, I think, Princess. King Jeel took your mother away from you, and you should despise him. Now you're just letting Harden make a fool out of you. I probably am a fool. I did as he asked because he told the people of Gra uh, wished for their motherland's restoration. But hardly, Harden only intended to use us. Now that we've outlived our use, he's tossed us aside like rubbish. All the same, I won't move. My men are not disposable. How sad. You'll have new recruits hold back the elite army alone? The Altean army alone? Fine. If you say you'll remain here, then I'll fight for you until the end, too. Well, this should be fun, at least. Samson, why would you do this? Don't your mercenaries only live for gold? I have no more to give you. Well, I don't quite get it either. But there are times when a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. That's all I can say, for now. Besides, I want to see how that kid fights. If he's a true hero, perhaps your decision will change. Alright, so... Let's visit this village. <clears throat> Prince Marth, I've been waiting for you. I'm Tomas, an Arcanean soldier, or was. I've since retired from the army. The Arcanaeans here just want to sacrifice defenses across soldiers. The act of brutality by my former homeland, I cannot tolerate. Please, Prince Marth, let me fight alongside you in some way. These bases are not good for this point in the game. enough. How fast are they? Oh! Nobody can actually double them. Got it. Nobody can actually double units anymore. Enemies are getting really tanky now. God, why does my character suck? I honestly may keep Sheeta as a paladin. Just because then she can actually use that extra speed. Yeah, so don't kill the level the level one dudes, right? Yeah, anybody that says Gra just like Avoid killing them and hopefully good things will happen. Um, let's see. Serious. Dang. Even with weapon triangle advantage. At least I can do something with the Lady Sword. And I still get hit for 20 damage. It'd be nice to just have Katarina just use stabs. Yeah. 
Ricky. Um. Honestly, Sirius is the one that's in danger right now, and he's at full health. Alright, let's see how this goes. Ooh, good dodge. Less than good. Less than good get hit, got hit. Alright. I think uh, Pal is going to hit uh, D rank uh, with axes, which will be good. And honestly, getting rid of these guys, it's great. It saves me the trouble. And then Marth can go over there nice and safe. Alright. Goodbye, Mr. Ruffian. I'm assuming he won't attack me. It'll just be that guy that attacks. Um, Seal actually can't reach anything else besides this guy, so I guess we'll just have to Seal kill that guy. Alright, well, let's see, uh, I guess heal me up, Are you sure. That's unfortunate. Uh, maybe Sheeta Sheeta can't reach. Oh, that's frustrating. I'll we'll figure out how to do this. This guy is fast. You need to have 23 speed to actually do something. You know, Tomas? Here, you can do something. Moss did a thing. Um, let's see. Tiki up. Fortunately, Sheeta's got to go all the way around, which kind of blows. Keep Katria far away. Keep Julian far away. At least start getting them closer. I want to get that nose for Atu. That would be a time to crit. Nope. Of course, when I, like, want to crit, it doesn't happen. This fool! Like, if this was, like, one chapter later, Pala would not be able to do this. Because they would probably have like 19 speed or something. How? Jeez, these silver weapons are really insane. Um, I want to get a kill with Tiki, but I literally can't. You'll be fine, right? You won't miss, right? Good. Okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. How much damage does Tiki do to this guy? Oh, really one damage short? That's a crime. I'll have Katria give a little poke. I think she's close to a level up anyways. Ah, uh, not that close, apparently. Come on, Tiki, you got this. Heck yeah.
Let's mend. Goodbye, mend staff. You will not really be missed that much. I'm gonna be honest. Um, yeah, let's start move. Let's start moving at least a character that way. I can lure out that guy over here. Martha over this way. Pala can just like move over this way. Anything at the vendor that's worth buying? Nah. Um, let's see. Does this guy have a door key? Julian that way. I can at least buy a door key over that way. Ow. Uh, I'm gonna have to warp somebody over if I want that Nosferatu tome. It's worth it. I can speed, so I need somebody that can double. I could do it. One warp use for, for a 24 use tome. I'm actually starting to do some stuff now. I'm like, I think I'm just fast enough to start to double like a decent amount of things on this stage, which is like big important. Well, oh, I can buy a lot of silver weapons. By a lot, I mean like two because I'm poor. <laughs> frustrating. You know, maybe I shouldn't have teleported right on top of the ruffian. That was maybe a slight misplay. It's fine. I have the Nosferatu tone now. I feel like we're in a pretty good position now. I could probably use a battle save. Oh, fucking course. Of oh, fucking course. Literally the second I use a battle save. It's alright, you're all good. I'm just in pain. Oh god, I hate ambush spawns. I hate ambush spawns so much. Oh, that's so dumb. That is so, so dumb. I just made the battle save too. That is so sad. Literally, like, the, the exact second. It was a bad idea. Alright, get a Silver Lance. You need more damage. Um... I guess I can grab a steel sword so that I'm not constantly using the lady sword. Julian, get rid of all this stuff. 
I'm tempted to change Pala to a Paladin and then give her a Speed Wing. It's very tempting. Honestly, should I just give Sheeta Strength Booster right now? Yeah, I could say I could say it's worth it to use on her. She's really good. She's really good. And I also have so many with what the heck? I also could use one. We're at the point in the game where I could I should probably just use these. I'll save one. I'll save one for later. Um, let's see. What else can I do? What else can I do? Uh, should I give Cecile more magic? I could just give her more magic. She is my she is my main magic carry, so it'd probably be preferable just to keep pumping her with a uh, with some spirit dust. Cause that'll bring her up to 18 magic, which is really good. Let's get that Thoron back. Also, change some of my positioning a little bit. So this guy is like really fast, so I need somebody that can actually like do the big kill. Oh, Martha's cap speed. I didn't even notice. Catcher is like kind of useless right now. Yeah, I could you have Cecile do that, and then I could like warp her next turn. Yeah, that sounds good. All right, let's try this again. Get a very mid unit. is insane. I'm so glad I, I'm so glad I have her. Alright. Um now Catri is not fast enough. What I can do is I can do I can do a double with uh, Sheeta pretty safely. Never mind, not very safely. That crit's nice though. She's got really good speed, but she doesn't have weapon rank, which is the issue here. Because without the weapon rank, she's not getting extra avoid, which does kind of suck. Uh, how far away is the sniper? I want to stay out of his range. Start moving people over. Let's just skip the, these first few enemy phases since we were like halfway through the chapter anyways. All right, where are we warping you? So we got to warp you to this thief. All right, and since you're on your own, I'm definitely gonna be picking, picking that uh, Nosferatu tome up. Honestly, that was just such a bad play of me of putting putting it uh, to seal right at like the place where she couldn't move. That was so dumb of me. Good stuff. Good stuff.
Shout out to Moss. Do something, I guess. Oh, kill for Tiki? Kill for Tiki? Nice 50 XP for her. Why does that ruffian have a heal staff? Like, heal staff is like worth nothing at this point. Right, heal with the men's staff. Get Sheeta all healed up. I guess kill this guy. That one. Can't quite kill with the Lady Sword. I'll equip it though. Get Julian over here. That's not based on turn, that's based on location. I mean, Zeke's probably gonna die as well. Oh my god, she dodged a hit, but she's probably still gonna die to that last guy. God, she had a lance equipped. It worked. That guy's gonna die. That guy's gonna die, same as before. Ah, so close, so close. It was probably max range. We wanna have Tiki alive. All right, I know now, I know now. This time, this time we got this. This time we got this. Alright. Doing the same thing I did with that. Seal. You know, mate, I'm thinking actually. Just warp turn one, just get just get it over with. Just rip the band-aid off. Warper all the way over there. It should be out of the Berserker's range. Just like move everybody away. Spawn those Dra Draco Knights. Just get them out of here. Because that's the time pressure on this map, right? Oh, shit, I forgot about this guy. That'll work. Yeah, that'll work. Let's just kill this guy. Yup, it's just time. Alright, we should be good. We've seen this stuff a few times already. We should be fine. That's actually too many. I could rescue as well. That may be what I have to do. I may have to rescue as well.
Because, like, I want to equip this. That's the thing. But I have too much stuff in my inventory. Turns out Martha's a pretty good unit. Let's get you let's get you out of there. We've done our we've done our emergency maneuvers. I'll use Divine Stone just for that 100 percent accuracy right now. How much speed does this guy have? 19, so I need 24 to double. Yeah, she to kills, which is good. The issue is this guy. If I land a crit, that'd be good. Of course, I don't land a crit using the killer weapon. Um, I've gotten myself into a, a bit of a predicament. Actually, what I could do, um, Palak can come back, kill this guy. I'll kill with the javelin, so then that other archer should die. Yeah, that sniper will just destroy themselves on me. Can I double this guy? I can double this guy. Kill this guy. I'll probably take a counterattack, but I'm hoping I don't. They do be trying to make my life just like a little bit more difficult. Hopefully that's gonna be enough. That should be enough. She should be able to take one hit. Strange choice. I'm thinking because it had that percent chance to crit that it was like, hey, there's a small chance we one shot. After our strange maneuvers, we are we are back in control. Pally, you keep doing your thing. Alright, now dealing with this one. First we need to we need to do some healing. Uh Cecile can just destroy this guy. Ben, kill this guy. Um, I actually want to build up sword rank. What's her sword rank? It's like low E. It's gonna be a while. Ooh, silver lance and a spear. Who's got a higher defense? Sirius is higher defense, so we'll send Sirius that way. Weapons equipped. Right, we've got this Berserker to worry about. Um, I should be able to take it. This is just that one enemy. I should be able to take it. Next, Marth. Right, Marth, you get moving. You know, I worry about. I worry about that tile. What I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna store all this stuff. I'm gonna have Tomas just like sit on that tile. If he dies, he dies. Makes 
sense. Goes after Sirius, because Sirius is just weaker. Never mind, that crit was nasty. Steel Sword. You know, I do have Mercurius. I should maybe give Mercurius to somebody. Can Sirius use Mercurius? No, he can't. Big sad. He was able to. That would have been sick. Let's go, Catria! Do less damage. Do, like, no damage, even though I've invested in you since Chapter 2. Make room for Sheeta. It's crazy how much better Sheeta turned out than Katria, even though I had Katria so much earlier. It's kind of sad. It's 25 cap? Yeah, 25 is cap. Unfortunate, but we'll make do. Alright. Let's get a. Uh... Get the gang moving. Okay, because we're going to be soon getting to a point where we're going to have to be dealing with enemies with capped uh, stats. That's not going to be fun. Pala just annihilates anything she sees. Right, um, you need to trade up staff rank. The fastest paladin I have over on this side. I feel like Sheeta's gonna be enough. have Katria just in case. Alright, what's over here? Oh, please spare me. I have nothing left to give. Please don't get the wrong idea. We're not here to take anything from you. But did you Altians come to exact revenge on us? No, we've no intention to fight Grog. Grog and Altia were like siblings once. You speak truly? Then I shall give you my dearest, most precious treasure. Like angelic rooms. Angelic rooms are kind of good. Even with weapon triangle advantages, still have so much accuracy. Let's go, TG. I really hope she gets a few good level ups, though, because I'm investing quite a bit into her. Now that's what I'm talking about. It's really just the low HP. Honestly, I may just give her the, that angelic robe. Probably best to just go this way. Yeah, that was kind of expected. So, I'll be taking 15. She'll be fine. Um, let's see. Oh, I do have a dorky over here, so I don't need to wait.
thing the crit missed. Imagine if she got crit, that would have been so sad. Unfortunately, no avoiding that. Oh, wait. We can trap this guy. We can trap this guy. Closer. Probably open next turn. Treasure. It's potentially a kill for uh, Catria. Let's go. Good stuff. Come on, Catria. Please get a good level up. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. not look very nice at all. Maybe Marth can talk with with Sheena. That's what I'm assuming, but as long as I don't kill any any of the grust units. I don't think those guys will be able to reach this turn, at least. I'm hoping that Pal will be able to kill the... kill the snipers. That's kind of what I'm hoping. Yeah. She's, like, just strong enough with that javelin. Now we gotta deal with those guys. Fun stuff. Secret book. Eh. Uh, can I get over there from here? No, I can't. I gotta go all the way around. Stay there. You can make your way over. Alright, how are we gonna deal with these guys? Um. Cecile can kill one of them. Seal, kill the far away one. Yeah, they have a silver lance too. Let's get rid of that one. Easy. Um, Katarina could at least do damage, and then somebody else can finish. Fast enough. I'm fast enough, but not strong enough. Never mind. The crit was the crit was nice. Yo, Tiki. Hey yo. Hey yo. Let's 
for Divine Stone. No, we have to use some Divine Stone charges to get Tiki going, but hopefully it'll be it'll be worth it. She's getting like a lot of XP. Alright, um. Can I just like kill that one with a javelin? Nice and easy. Hammer and a silver axe. Let's, uh, let's see. I mean, like, chances are he's not gonna die. I forgot how low that guy was. There was there was a potential. There was potential. Yeah, that would have been exact. 14 plus 18. That would have been really sad. But we're fine. Nice. That's a good level up series. Alright. Um You need a new healing staff. Let's get that new one. out of here. Get another one? Nice. Tiki? Hey, yo. I'm still not risking that. I'm still not risking that 80% hit chance. We're so far in the chapter at this point. Keep them far away from everything. I have a strange feeling there's gonna be more ambush spawns somewhere, so I'm gonna keep them far away. Oh, I do have to move Julian though. Gotta get Julian out of there. Maybe I'll get her close enough to being able to use warp. All right, I do actually need to move Julian. That sucks. Which means I do have to move the rest of them. I'm just so worried about ambush spawns. I worry that he's gonna move. I mean, it will Oh, I will exactly kill him. That's so sad. I actually can't stay out of his range. Ooh, what I can do? Grab an iron sword and equip the iron sword. I'm a genius. Oh, wait, there's not even a treasure chest over here. What am I- Why am I trying to rush Julian over here? cannot prevail, but Shima deserves better than this. Trying not to kill you, Samson. There we go. Princess Shima, thank goodness. It's good to see you're well. Let us be clear, I do not hold animosity towards the Kingdom of Gra. Our kingdoms were once one. It grieved to watch us go, uh, go our separate ways in the last war. Princess Shima, I would like to try once more. I do not wish to fight with Gra. It's Mark. It surprised me to learn that you hadn't laid a finger on my fleeing soldiers. You may just be the second coming of King Henri. I believe you. It's not too much to ask. Please accept the people of Gra as you would those of Altia. I trust all of my country to you, Prince Mark. Well, Sheena, guess my job here is done. Samson, you're leaving? I don't think you'll be needing me. After all, the Prince will protect you from here on. Don't go. Please, don't go. 
What? Are you making me stay? This ain't like you. Well, whatever. If you still need me, I'm not going anywhere. Wherever you go, I'll protect you. Is that the deal? Yes. I wonder how she would be in a different class. Probably... N she has good rank. She has a good lance rank, at least. Samson is pretty mid. He's got a, he's got a high axe rank, so it makes him a decent axe user. I don't have too many good... I don't really have a high axe user. Or high ranked axe user, except for, like, Minerva. So it would not be terrible. It would not be too terrible. Desire to keep fighting like this is pointless. All we are accomplishing is buying hard and more time. My thoughts exactly. If we continue like this, more blood will be spilled for none. Flair, do you have any sort of plan? According to our information, the enemy's primary force is concentrated along the highway. What if we can avoid that route by passing through the mountains? We have to cross Adria Pass, but the steep mountains make it uh, dangerous for an army of our size. That's true. I fear the enemy might prepare to ambush as well. Our bravery would be our undoing. But it is the fastest possible route. If we could just break through here, we'd be walking in walking distance of the palace. I am prepared for the danger. We managed to conquer the same perilous road that Armory Walk compared to that. Jake and Flair, we can overcome this challenge. Order the advance. Who is this guy? Oof. Seems to have finally caught up. And you're? My name is Frost. I'm a priest of Macedon. Macedon was taken by the warmongering, warmongering rebels. He came to save our country. Thanks to you, my family is now safe. Come to return the favor. I see, there hasn't been some time since Prince Marth freed Macedon. The army marched at a speed the old geezer couldn't keep up. Eventually, I lost sight of you. And I heard that Marth had freed Altia as well, and I managed to catch up with you here in Gra. I'm old, but I can still fight. Please allow me to join you. Uh, sure. Battle of the Pass. Aiming to avoid needless battles, the Altian army decided to cross the central mountain range, thought to be impassable by a large army. Should they go through the Adrio Pass, they would reach the palace directly. Hurry, we cannot let the enemy notice us, we must charge tr straight through. Praying for success, Marth and the others walked through the narrow mountain pass. However, despite their prayers, they were attacked by an unexpected enemy in the pass. The northern kingdom of Aurelius's elite force, which had moved south to aid Arcanea, the Wolf Guard. Flair, if we get through this pass, we'll be on Arcanea's doorstep. We just hang in there a little longer. Yes, sire. Despite all the odds, we've surpassed Henri's way and taken back Altia. The battles we faced up till now, they've been uh, nothing short of difficult, and in those battles... The feeling of pain overwhelms me. When I think of the severely wounded and the many who have fallen, perhaps I've been stronger like Henri, then everyone would still be alive. From now, from now on, I will definitely... Sire. I'm sorry, I just like, I literally could not be bothered. Sedgar and Wolf, what did they do to you? Oh, this, this map looks uh, pretty rough out of 10. This definitely looks like the kind of kind of chapter you'd like try to warp skip, but I don't have two A rank. Let me check. Let me check that new guy. Ah, he's got C rank. Do I have anybody else with A rank? Just gotta look through my many 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 units. I'd have to warp two people over. It would be funny, but I probably it probably wouldn't be optimal to do. So I'm not going to. But it, but I think about it. I think about it. I actually want to see how she looks like. Recla Sheena looks like Reclass. She d I don't think she's gonna be good. Oh yeah, never mind. Her stats are garbage. stats are very, very bad. Eh, he was, he's fine as a hero. 
So you got less strength, more speed, less defense. What can I change Minerva into, actually? Maybe I could turn her into something that's better. Ah, uh, Draconet's the only thing that has, a uh, Whatever it's called. Axes. Alright, so... Probably don't need Julian. Take Samson Zane or Fina Zane? Probably Fina Zane. The question is, what do I want to turn Zane into? Let's see. Uh, probably my. I could either Sheeta. Sheeta or Pala, probably. Probably just do Sheeta, because Sheeta has better. Eh, I don't know. I don't know. We'll I'll, I'll see how I'm feeling. I'll see how I'm feeling. This is definitely looking like a rough one, though. It's like a really rough start. It looks like they kind of want you to just like run to the left. That cave looks kind of suspicious. Alright, so I think what I'm gonna want to do... Put my most mobile units to the on this side, so then I can get them out of there. But I do need to kill these two. That's my... That's my... Three to four. This is definitely gonna be a kind of chapter where we have to experiment. So as the Arcanian army, Emperor Harden has one other strong set of troops under his command. They're the Aurelian Knights, the powerful or army nicknamed the Wolf Guard. The Wolf Guard. Yes, in the previous war, the Wolf Guard fought as Harden's subordinates. They were reliable allies back then, since Harden is our enemy, so is the Wolf Guard. They have sworn loyalty to Harden and would die for him. Flair, their loyalty is comparable to yours. Take good care once they arrive on the battlefield. The house is almost within sight. By crossing the mountains, we avoided pointless battles as much as we could. We must defeat Garnif and rescue Princess Elise and the other kidnapped clerics. We ought to do something about Harden, who's now being controlled by the Dark Sphere. All right, let's see how this goes. We're, this is definitely going to be an experimenting kind of chapter. Wolf Sedgar Violent, do you not have second thoughts? Does this battle pl battle plan not trouble you? Rashia, are you still babbling on about that nonsense? Look over there. Altian forces are stretched along the narrow pass. Only chance to crush him is now. What's wrong with you, Rashia? The four of us not all pledged we would die for Coyote. Because Coyote freed us as uh, us plane dwellers from slavery. If we don't fight Altia here, we can't protect the palace. Are you telling me you want Harden to be de defeated then? That's right. Prince Marth wants to destroy Arcanae and everything we hold dear. Leave him be, the entire world will eventually fall into his hands. I still find it hard to believe. So the Honorable Prince Marth uh, we met is supposed to harbor diabolical ambitions? Are you ca calling Coyote a liar? Do you really believe that he would resort to such deceitful tactics? Enough, Rashia. I've lost all respect for you. Betray us if you want. I don't care. Sedgar, Violet, let's go. If we delay any more, they will pass us. Wait, you know I can't betray you. Understand. I'll go too. Of guard our Aurelis. Must we fight them as well? Sire, please hold on. We just received word from a messenger of King Aurelis. See, it seems Aurelis has no plans to war. According to the messenger, King Aurelis wishes to parlay with you in the village. What? What could this mean? Was the, that the wolf guard is moving independent of Aurelis' orders? I don't know. But depending on how negotiations go, it's possible to uh, the wolf guard may signal a retreat. You see, it benefits us all if we can avoid pointless fighting. Let's hurry to the village. Oh, uh, we can do that. We can do that. So what's max range? There. Oh, uh, yeah. We can do this. We can do this. So, like, right here. Dance. Oh, 
Oh, Prince Mark, I thank the stars I can beat you here. King Aurelis, what brings you here? I came to halt our attack. I must apologize to you. I believed Harden and sided with Arcanea, but it seems I made a mistake. Aurelius has decided to maintain neutrality. My knights will return to their lands. I understand, Your Majesty. I do not wish to fight you either. Please find it in yourself to forgive my, uh, me for the many Aurelian lives that I've taken. Oh, the rumors are true, as I suspected. I am old and frail and without children. And now, the brother I once trusted has become like this. Prince Marth, please, protect Aurelius in my stead. I entrust everything to you. As a sign of my allegiance, I would have you accept this war. Your Majesty, Harden is. Do not worry about my younger brother. A king can only die a knight's death. It was always his fate. The Life Spear. Restore 20 HP every turn when held. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Again, that cave looks suspicious. Seal kill one of them? Nah, she doesn't have the move. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna like, I'm just gonna huddle around her. So that space can still be attacked by both, unfortunately. All right, there we go. We've successfully protected, protected her. All right, let's see how this how this turn one goes. We'll make further decisions after uh, seeing it. Zane is such a funny unit. Just going straight for him. Good thing Marth is disgustingly strong. Doesn't really have, even have that much to gain anymore. All right, chapter is immediately not too scary anymore. I don't know what's who I want to give this sphere to. You know what I do want to do? I want to give... Where is it? Uh, Angelic Robe. Give that to Tiki. I knew it looked sus. An arm scroll? That's beautiful. If I can get somebody to B rank stabs, that means I can just immediately put them at A rank. And that is huge. Now the real question is how am I gonna deal with these guys? Oh wait, I have Pala. Pala, please carry me to victory as always. question is who uh, I think probably Katarina because Katarina uh, she doesn't do a lot of magic damage Cecile does I'm probably gonna be wanting Cecile to actually like do damage life sphere is actually pretty good though Fly her over, kill the ballista, and then we can actually, like, progress. Oh, perfect. She's just enough.
Oh, uh, specialist rescue, that's what it is. Oh no! <laughs> it still missed. Alright, that's actually that's actually pretty nice. is not fast enough to double these guys. That is sad. Oh, that had one use. That is, that is also sad. gonna do this. Well, I guess uh, Zane can kill one. Uh, let's bow. These two have silver bows, so watch out for those guys. Are you doing something? Let's go. Alright, so I need to kill the one with the Rider's Bane. The issue is then there are bow units to worry about. So here's here's the idea. Here's the idea here. Is I'll use. Uh, yeah, I'll use those for out It's fine. Oh, nice! Saving a use. This guy just has a silver lance, nothing too special. exactly what I was hoping for. And this is why we like Nosferatu. Because we bait the enemies. Because, yeah, she takes a ton of damage. But she also heals it all back. Pal is going to be fine. getting killed. God. Katria can do something. Let's go. Poke. Poke. Got a 
cover. That's always nice. Slightly out of range. Ah, that was a mistake. Um, we can just do something like this. Move just a little bit. I wish I could get boots on. Um, this guy have a weapon now. I'm good. Now the question is, how do I want to kill this guy? This is actually, it's actually, this is actually fodder for Tiki. Wait, this guy's just a generic, what the heck? Yeah, I'll just get the kill in one shot. That's so sad. He's gonna be killed this generic boss. Right, is there a way I can just like weaken without killing? It's like how much damage does Tiki do? Just some, not a ton, but some. That should be enough. As long as I don't crit, which there's always that possibility. <laughs> now nah, we're good, we're good. We gotta feed Tiki, we gotta find a way to feed Tiki XP. Now with that extra Seraphrobe, she looks a lot healthier overall. Alright, no strength, but the speed. Honestly, I'm happy she's getting speed. Another quick chapter. Blair, we made it through. The palace is not far. I'm only to thank you for this. You do nothing but help me. No, nah, it's not like that. It was your decision, sire. I just came up with that idea. That's hardly the whole truth. At times when I'm lost in my thoughts, if you're there, I have confidence. I'm thankful for that more than anything. Sire, we just received urgent news. Apparently a coup d'etat uh, broke out in the palace. Knights and citizens who opposed Emperor Hardin's ways rose in rebellion. What in place would happen to them now? Fortunately, the instigators were all defeated and captured. Rumor has it the rebels are being executed by the day. Damn it, Hardin, this is absurd. Decided we will head for the palace once and end it. At once and end it. Play it, let's go. Yes, sire. Chapter 19, the final battle. Imperial calendar, the year 3, February. The Holy Palace of Arcanea was enveloped by a strange silence. Following rebellion in Arcanea, many capable knights, starting with the Paladin Medea, were captured. However, even uh, then, Arcanea had double Altea's manpower. The palace streets teeming with soldiers. Nearly one year has passed since the Crustian expedition. Now, the decisive battle that would settle the fate of the two nations was about to begin. See, like, this, like, the enemies around here just look really nasty. So, uh, like, Sedgur, Wolf, Roshia, like, all those units, they're, like, very spread out in this chapter. Ooh, this is gonna be a rough one. Like, this is definitely, like, another warp skippable chapter. Like, I'm very tempted, but I'm not going to. Yeah, this seems like a fine... Same same team is perfectly fine. If 
Slayer. We got a report about the Wolf Guard, whose forces withdrew yesterday. It seems some of them emerged with the Arcanian army. The Wolf, Wolf Guard's commander, Wolf, is currently confirmed to be among them. We'll have to fight him again? Yes, it'd be ideal if we could persuade them, but if we don't know how, we may have no choice but to fight. They're strong. Be careful. I come to this palace at the center of Arcanea with three objectives in mind. To save Harden from the Dark Spear, rescue the kidnapped clerics, and defeat Garnet the Dark Pontifex. Seems there was a rebellion in the palace not long ago. Citizens and knights rioted against Harden's actions. However, they were defeated and now await execution by Harden. Harden has really changed. Prince Marth came here wanting to save Harden, but we might already be too late. No matter how many people would forgive Harden, no or how many people want him to be freed from the Dark Sphere, the cold hard truth is that Harden has stolen the lives of many innocents. It's unbearable to remember that he was once our comrade. Um, I don't think we need to make any changes. I think I may want to make, uh... Just so I don't have to tiptoe around. Make her a paladin. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have Minerva. But Zane is just better. Swords, we have some range. Uh, I'm gonna throw throw back the life sphere. I'm gonna grab. Can't use you can't use Mercurius surprisingly. Um, honestly, Pala. All right, so getting a steel axe, javelin. Where is the life sphere? Because she's going to be like in the front lines, like doing shenanigans. I don't really care who gets. I don't really care who gets this. Last one. Uh, I don't want to give her something a little, little weaker. In case she needs to hold back. Guess I'll give myself the light sphere. Alright, let's see how this goes. I suspect the Arcanian army is very powerful. We must approach with great caution. It seems that Harden has assembled the entire army for battle. Even so, the people have lost their faith in Emperor Harden. They will welcome us as liberators. It is very reassuring. This is our final battle. It may drag on all the same, but I ask you to take utmost care. We have the enemy is the Arcanian Imperial Army, the strong continent's strongest and most renowned military force. Strange, but I'm not afraid. If you're here, everything will be okay. Everyone, let's go. All right. Like, Pala could just, like... Pala could just, like deck them. Just like a little bit of help. I think I may want to actually just kill one of those guys. I need to worry about Wolf. So they don't want to kill him. It would be optimal to not kill him. But I also could just could just do that and not care. Because let's see. He's got 14 defense. Pala's got a metric ton of attack. Yeah, he's like covering that like entire space. Honestly. Just go. Just do your thing. Go queen. Slay.
Thank you. Sheeta? Perfect. That works. Well, these guys actually kind of hurt. These guys actually kind of hurt. Goodbye, Wolf. I'm Wolf the Wolf Guards Commander. Your head is mine. Oh, you're living. Surprisingly. Life Sphere, let's go. Could kill the Fortify. Okay, there's two Fortifies. But I think the goal is to just kill these guys. It should be healing like 20 HP a turn anyways. Everybody, everybody do that sweet zigzag. But I, at least I do have that arm scroll. Oh, Jesus Christ. Maybe I was slightly over-aggressive. Jesus, those package arms hurt. Oh, that guy had a rider's band. I thought he would have had a silver weapon. That's my mistake. Good level up. I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it so hard. Because I was over aggressive with Pala. Hey, I was curious though. Oh, I was gonna say there's actually a small chance that she lived if she didn't kill anything, but... These guys have just high, high, such high hit rates. She's still living somehow. There we go, that's gonna be it. I was just curious. Now let's... There we go. Alright. What have we learned today? Don't do that. <sighs> Looks like... The... The only way... You could like... You could warp this. Skip this chapter. I'm not gonna do that, cause like that's. I, I want to know what's in this village mostly. <laughs> if I could just get whatever's in the village, I'd be happy. Honestly, I want. I also want the dragon shield. I want the dragon shield off of Wolf, cause I could give that to somebody that needs defense. Which is, uh, me, apparently. I have 13 defense. Jeez, that's so low. Like, Sheeta has more defense than me. Nothing's happening except the thieves move. Let's 
Alexia, Katarina, Vegeta, Diggy. Pala, please stop this fool. This guy with the Riders Band is kind of nasty. I think I'm just gonna have to have Paolo like bait him out. Nope, not that way. There we go. Take like two hits. Oh! Knew it, you intended to invade Coyote's palace. King forbade us from entering or interfering, but I'll do anything to protect Coyote. I'll defy his edict even if I have to. Okay! Hey, 12% hit chance. That guy's dead. This may actually be a bit much, even for Pala. This may be a bit much for Pala. Oh my god. Every single one of these things are, land are hitting. Yeah, and she's dead. Oh, going for Marth. Okay, okay, that's good. How did you not land a crit with 64% hit chance? Or crit chance. Yeah, that's it. Oh, God. These guys are insane. Like, that's just a tight time to make. Like, I legit think maybe I just warp, warp Marth over there. Throw him in a forest and, and pray he lives. Let's give it a try, honestly. This, I think I'd be able to avoid one. Hala could maybe just reach over there normally and uh, I'd just be able to aggro less enemies. That is also another thing that could happen. But well, let's see, let's see how it goes. There was actually combat happening. I should have. This guy's a silver bow. You're the worst. I will be able to kill this guy.
Now, who's gonna recruit Violent, actually? Who's gonna recruit, recruit Violent? I didn't think this through. find out. This is probably Marth that recruits Violent. Because I need Marth. Because I, I need, I, I mean, I need Violent to recruit, um, whatever the other guy is to recruit. Basically, I need them all to recruit each other. It's kind of a pain. Rashia. Prince Marth, it is I, Rashia of the Wolf Guard. I received King Aurelis' pardon, and I've been waiting for you. I'm truly sorry for the battle of the past. I realize that an apology means little, so I'll fight under your banner. But the other Wolf Guard members have all sided with the Arcanaean army. I wonder if I could persuade them. Violently, he may listen to what I have to say. guys. Like, as a unit, he's just kind of mid. It may be easiest to just rescue him. If I, if I need to rescue him, I'll rescue him. Good job, Fina. Too bad you don't really need stats. Try this. Rider's Bane be Rider's Bane. Alright, there's Violent. Let's see how this goes. Oh, that's Zane. That's not Cheetah. That'll be fine, actually. What? Not as fine. Not as fine. Got hit by a 40% chance. Oh, that's so annoying. That's so annoying. These guys are, are evil. Just the placement is so awful. Oh, I can't lose Zane. Zane is essentially just copying a good unit. Maybe give Palo that really good, um, that really good javelin. I'm gonna push Palo as far as I can this turn. Pick out as many of those guys as I can. I think Marth was actually really good at baiting out those guys. I don't want to be too 
far behind, but it is what it is. Alright, skip a few skip the first few turns because we've already seen them. Alright, good stuff. Kill this guy. Get hit. I think I will. I'm gonna physic. The enemy placement in this map is pretty nasty, all things considered. Getting to Roshia is it's so tight. Like, I'm using Mar Mart's movement to the max. Right, this is good. Some of these guys will just die on Pala, which is so nice. Alright, and they're moving out, too. That's perfect. That's perfect. like some overlap but not too much nothing nothing notable there's no there's no notable overlap which is good oh, I can one shot with a wing spear let's go Book. Actually, I gotta kill this guy so then I can actually book it a little faster. Um, how can I deal with this guy? This guy's got 18 speed. I think I'm gonna have to double team it. Never mind, Sirius got this with the crew. Now Marth can just move a little bit further. attack these guys. Uh, I don't want to aggro that next group quite yet. Fina is pretty far behind though. Super far behind. Uh, looks like she should be able to get out of the way. Yeah, but only for this turn, it's not enough. Uh, and also, Sedgar. I can maybe cage Sedgar in. Here's the, again, here's the issue. Only do so much. All right, Zane's got this one. Really? Can't kill. All right, I can kill this guy at least. to anything nice and easy, unfortunately. So I need I need Marth to get over there like yesterday. 
Alright, the thief won't reach the village. He's just gonna keep going for it. That's fine. Alright, don't need to worry about this guy. Great. I gotta deal with that guy with killer bow. Not unfortunately kill I think maybe together they can kill this guy. Anybody? He doesn't have this. Yeah, he doesn't have the speed to actually kill anybody. So I'm gonna create a save. We'll see what happens. Monster, why are you invading other nations? Are you so confused? Consumed by petty ambition. Alright, he's not dead. That's good. That's good. Alright, we're gonna have to do some we're gonna have to do some evasive maneuvers. Alright. Visit, recruit. Katarina's got a rescue staff. Where's, where's, uh, okay, Violand. Probably gonna have to go, like, over here. Get Roshia. Have him talk to Violand. Violand, why are you here? The king told us not to interfere. Have you decided to join the Altean army like me? Yeah, I came to bring you back. Why have you turned out like LTNs? We are the Coyote subordinates. Open your eyes. You're being deceived. You're wrong, Violent. The time I spent with the LTNs was short, but I know one thing for sure. It's not as the Coyote says. They're not evil people. Rashia. Violent, please. I don't want to fight all of you, especially you, Violent. Well, Rashia, you were always the kindest out of the Wolf Guard. You've always been able to tell which were the good guys and which were the bad. You can't fight you, Rashia. If you, our brother in arms, are sure, then I believe you. I'm your ally from now on. Violent! He just dies straight to those guys. Alright. So, what I need to do... Am I gonna have to use another rescue staff? Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to actually kill anybody. If I... Because I need to do, like... Alright, I think... Can Tiki, can Tiki do something? Tiki can do a decent jump. But I think what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to do... Cecile kills two enemies. Good job, Vina. gonna use this up should I make a battle save now so what I can do is special rescue rescue violent and talk to Sedgar Sedgar hold on it's me violent 
What's the meaning of this, Violin? Don't tell me you've defected. Listen, Cedric, I don't know. What am I supposed to do? I love Coyote like a brother. All I wanted was to fight for him, but he's changed for the worse. Even though it's as though he's someone else now. Wanted to serve him always. That's why I've been turning a blind eye. Shut myself. Trying to remember the Coyote who loved us so long ago. Really hurt to face the truth that Coyote's not who he used to be. Just don't know anymore. Hey, Sedgar, what the hell am I supposed to do? Violin. I too feel the same way. I know he's gone. But look the other way around and block my senses. One day he'll be back to our Coyote. That's what I kept telling myself. Roche is gone over the LTNs. I can't fight him. Sedgar, you should come too. I don't know what's right anymore, but I want to fight you either. Yes. Even though the Coyote's madness was clear to me, I did nothing. I have to make this right. Now, is he in range? He can do a whole 12 damage. Not the kind of damage I was hoping for. If I'm gonna be real. If I could just protect... Yeah, we should be able to... Yeah, the important people are protected. So we're good. I'll just put Palo over there. That's a lot of dudes. Ow. Rochea didn't die. Yeah, it's just a lot of movement. There's a lot of dudes are moving. Definitely, like, a really rough position to be in. I mean, worst comes to worst, I have a battle save where I can essentially just kite them out. Which is kind of nice. Katarina sets something up for, uh... Set something up for Tiki. Well, I guess I'll imitate Violin just so he can get get there quicker. No. Again, they're all just kind of bad. That's the most important one right now. I don't have the money to buy things right now. Like, I feel like that's way too aggressive for me to go for something like that. I got no healers over there, so it's probably worth using using a physic. It's really those mages that are the rough are the rough ones. I could just one shot that mage. It saves Palette 20 damage. I think that's actually worth it, especially because I have a battle save pretty close by. Really, another round. What the actual fuck game? Right, 
That guy's dying. Let's see. Let's see how many. Yeah, this one hits. Pal is dead. Yeah, she's she's done so. Yeah. Luckily, we have a battle, a pretty good battle save. movement. Now, I do like what I did before. I don't even care. Just die. We need to get people over there and stat. Well, Zane's gonna be significantly less useful. But, you know, when he untransforms in like five turns, I swear to God, he'll be good. Alright, so the second wave didn't spawn. So I guess once I enter, like, the center area, maybe that's when the second wave spawns. This one dies. Alright, 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 alright. Alright. Question is, how am I dealing with all these dudes? It's just one shot. Nobody ever has javelins anymore, or Volnieri's anymore. Uh, do that, do that. Worst comes to worst, we're in like a good defensible choke point. As long as I can, like, actually use that to my advantage. No way in hell am I, uh, waiting several turns, though, to, like, uh, wait out all those, uh, whatever they're called, ballistas. That's not worth it. Oh shit! Fucking Zane. Oh, uh, that's not good. Alright. 
Maybe I'll have to let them come out. Come out to me. I'm gonna have to bait them out and then just have my entire army ambush them. It's like... There's a lot of them. There's really just a lot of them. Kill a few with Pala. Get everybody ready. Oh yeah, I forgot about this guy. That's much better because they're like spread actually like spread out. So what I can do is I can just like I can kill this guy. That's the most important guy to kill. Um let's see, Rashida. This guy has the most HP, so we'll kill this guy with Sheeta. Come on, Cheetah, get that good level up again. Nope, okay, that's fine. This is fine. Let's see, anybody got Rider Banes? Nope. Loki, those two are fine. Stuff. Yo, Sedgur crit. Oh my god. That was actually that was actually so good. Now I'm actually now I'm in a good position. die in two hits, which is, that's, that's the important thing. Just barely enough health to live. Sec, so just gotta check a message. Good job, me. All right, let's see. Um, 
Martha. I know, I know Cecile doesn't need help getting kills, but like, in terms of like movement, this is pretty efficient for her. How many uses the packet? Wow, this. Oh, they don't even lose uses. They don't even lose uses. Well, that. That's unfortunate. Alright, so we have a few options here. Um. We can. Uh. I'm thinking about... Do I really want to use another rescue staff use? This chapter? Not really. On the other hand, do I, like, even have another choice? I need to, like, kill one, rescue out. Because I need to, like... Water. Yeah, pure water would be good in this situ a situation like this. Yeah, I would definitely be able to live a pachyderm. I have another javelin as well. how that works out. So I'm probably gonna need to use most of my units. Rashida. I may have to be able to attract a few people to go from Marth. See how this goes. That. Yeah. Oh, that's something. That's something. Baiting a unit out is good. Yo, the current Levin sword actually coming in clutch. Man, that was so good. that works out. Got basically everybody in range to do things. Let's see how this goes. Nothing aggroed quite yet. Which is mildly unsettling. I 
You just want to, like, aggro them and then peace out. Like, I think she'll be okay. Because now only one of them is attacking, not all of them. Martha's over there. Need to get my good units, like, ready. Ready to rumble. Seal. Can't really move to seal any closer, but like that's fine. Serious. Of Sedgar nearby, because he can at least do chip damage. I'm not a fan of this map. I don't like this map at all. I don't like it one bit. Alright. Good. That's a good start. Good start. Good start. Ow. Right, that guy's gonna hit. Oh, this guy's gonna kill. Oh, thank God he missed. Wolf, are you gonna kill yourself? No. You're going for Marth? Great. Wow, they really are going for Marth. This is great. This is perfect. Cause, probably because they don't see the kill, so they're going for the Lord. Oh, that was a good. That was a good dodge. My God, I think I'm actually gonna live. My God, I actually lived. Oh, right. Now, how can I just, like, overwhelm the enemy? Alright, so he hit his limit for movement. Now, the question is, do I want to be aggressive or not? Because the issue is that there are still these three pachyderms that I can't really do much about right this second. I'm just curious. What's, what's the forecast looking? It's not looking particularly great. How about this? I just want to stay out of that guy's range. <laughs> if I can stay out of that guy's range, I'll be happy. Like, I think she is strong enough. Let's see, 31. Nah, Pal's got much more defense. Pal's got much more defense. out of the way from my death ball. Quick nose for Atu. Then I think we should be able to just drain tank this. Oh, Wolf is gonna kill himself. Wolf is so killing himself. Sorry, Wolf. Ah, we almost did it. We almost did it. We almost got all four. We almost did it. So sad. Yeah, drain tanking is gonna work, though. Powell will get these guys near dead.
Doesn't really matter. I can just... I'll figure that out later. Just gotta deal with these stupid pachyderms now. Crit. Crit. Uh, who do I want to get this kill? Can I get it? Oh, I can. I'll work on my sword rank a little bit. That should be... I think that's level 10 for me. Nice. That's good, that's good. Ooh. I worry about these guys, though. Yeah, I would take too much damage in, in return. Unfortunate. It's a good idea. What I can do is I can, like, put myself in an advantageous position. Just a little bit closer so I can move somebody else up. Probably Zane. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? There's a third wave. Oh my god, I hate this so much. Pala, please. Please live. units. A third fucking wave. This ain't it. This ain't it. Dude, why? Is there, like, just... I'm uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna have to reset anyway, so I'm just like legitimately curious. Is this just a wave every time I kill a ballista or something? Or some stupid shit like that? No, I don't even know. It's whatever. All right, I think we're gonna have to continue this next next uh, next time. Ugh. I hate not finishing a chapter, but this is just this is just awful. That's just awful. Oh my god! I need to figure out how I'm gonna do that. I may need to just warp skip, but like, I'm gonna lose out on so much stuff. I want that. I really want that uh, Draco shield. I really don't know how, how I want to do it. We'll figure it out next time, though. All right. Have a good night, guys.